Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I have a thread up box. <laughs> if you guys don't know what thread up is, it's a um, kind of an online thrift store. Some things are new with tags, some things have been thrifted. Um, it's not exactly as cheap as a thrift store. Like you're not gonna go, you're not gonna find 50 cent, 75 cent dollar items, anything like that. But hopefully these prices are going to be better than Stitch Fix or Aiden West. So I don't know what you do. Pretty much it's the same thing as Stitch Fix. You go on there and you pay a styling fee of ten dollars which is half of what Stitch Fix is, more than, less than half, I think, by now. But you can get on there, you don't even have to do the styling thing. You can just go on there and purchase from them. And I will leave a link down in my description box of how to get to thread up. So anyway, um, what i done though, I kind of wanted to be surprised, like in all these subscription boxes, if I wanted to shop for myself, I could go just go on there and you know pick out some stuff, but that's not fun. Um, so, what I done was got the goodie box. So that's what this is. It's the goodie box where they pick out stuff for you from your styling profile and send it to you. This is a heavy box. I think they send 10 things, if I'm not mistaken. Now this box come today all beat up. Um, <laughs> it's got stamped all over it, received, unsealed. So I'm sure hoping that none of my stuff is gone or none of their stuff is gone because that would be a mess so i did take pictures of the box just to be on the safe side that if there's some things that are not in here that i didn't do it but yeah there's it just says all over it received unsealed i'm sure it just uh, popped open or what have you so I'm going to just get into the box, show you guys piece by piece what it is, and then I'm going to be doing a try on and let you guys know the prices. So hopefully this will be a better box than, than I mean, I like Stitch Fix clothes, some of them, but they're very high priced. Nadine West, I didn't really even like the clothes, and I thought, in my opinion, that some of the prices were too high for what you got. So anyway now i did go on to their site and i didn't pick out but i did the heart button or the like button and i guess they maybe they can go on and see what you liked i really don't know i have no idea what's in this box so we're going to just get started now this is the box that you have to send what you don't want back to them so be careful in the box be careful with the box because you do have to send the stuff back and it does come with a, a pre-stamped pre-stamped postage so that you don't have to pay to send it back you don't have to pay to get it you don't have to pay to send it back so it comes looking like this when you open it i don't see that this was messed up so just because the box was i don't I don't think anything like this was messed up. So let's see, this is my first time ever ordering from them. So let's see what it says. This is your return shipping label to put on the box to send back. And then here's my list. You can really get some good prices on, on here. This just says welcome and about your goodie box. And then it also comes with this pamphlet telling you about Thread Up. So, anyway, let's get on with it. And we are going to see what's in our box. Let's see if anything looks really used or beat up. I don't think they're going to have anything on there like that. So, anyway, did ask there's a place on there where you can request certain things and I did request shorts because it's 150 degrees outside and summer stuff and casual stuff so we're gonna see what they sent me okay first thing is looks like a black piece this is uh, it looks like a romper I don't know how well you can tell but it looks like a it's a romper and it is by the brand loft 
and some size six. That's pretty cute. So we're gonna try this on. And when I try it on, I'm gonna tell you how much it cost. The second thing is, this is cute. It's kind of a, feels like it might be a warm, warm fabric, I don't know. This is by the brand Simple Vera, Simply Vera. And it's cute. This is what the shirt looks like. I did ask for a medium, although just depends on the shirt. You know, sometimes you might wear a medium, sometimes you might wear a small, sometimes you might wear a large, sometimes you might wear an extra large, you can't never tell. So, but this is cute. It's got the black and white polka dots around the collar and around the sleeves and oh, all the way down the front. This is cute. Okay, I like black too. I love to wear black. So then the next thing, this is cute. This is like a halter top. I might should have asked for a small. It is kind of see-through, but it's cute. It's a halter. It's got the little tassel tie in the front. Very cute. Let's see what size this is in. A medium. This is by Loft as well. The next thing is by the brand for, for Cynthia. It's a medium. It's a white top. It is cute. Looks like it would get wrinkled real easy, but it is cute. Got buttons all the way down the front, functional buttons. I might be in trouble with this box, y'all because I know I can't keep everything in this box. So anyway, so then the next thing is by Zera, Zera, I don't even know what that, oh, this is cute. Look at this. This looks like kind of a denim, it's not denim, but, and it's got these kind of sleeves. I, I don't know, but that's cute. So it looks like on the bottom that's real cute next thing is this is a pretty color look at that color y'all I used to have a shirt something like this um, this doesn't say what brand it is but it's cute for sure I'm not exactly sure how to put it on it's got long sleeves it's very thin though. It's, it's kind of that see-through, see-through material for sure. I'm going to have to figure this out on what this is. But anyway, we'll work on that. And then the next thing is these. These are pants. Oh, kind of wanted shorts, but these are by the brand Gap. And this is a size 4. And these are cute though, and they've got the slit, little slit up the ankle on it. So there we go. Then these, these are not shorts, but these are by the Gap as well. They're stretchy. These are the dark denim, straight legged. Very cute. And I was hoping for shorts, but I didn't get any. But that, no idea, too. I got some pairs of shorts. So, this is by the brand White House Black Market. Never heard of those, but this is what these look like. Might be a little short, I'm not sure. But then they got the button, uh, the pockets in the back. Man, it's. Then there's these. These are Levi's. Yes, I would love it if these would fit me. These are by, like I said, Levi. They have the roll at bottoms. Very cute. Very. I'm excited. It's going to take me a while. It's going to be a little bit of a long video. So, anyway, let's get started trying on. I'm very excited about this one. Okay, so this is the first top. This is cute. Very cute, I think. Um, I like it. It's very soft. Very, very soft. And then I went ahead and went, here's the shirt. It's got the slit on both sides and just plain in the back. I did try on the 
went ahead and tried on the Levi shorts. This is what they look like. They're really cute. They're a little big, but I just don't see how I can go lower than a size four. They have the front pockets, of course. Levi's always fit me fairly well. They're the good size length. I would wear these. Very cute. Let's see how much all this costs. I'm very curious to see how much it costs. It's got the littlest writing in the world, but we're going to try to see it. Okay, so this is the Simply Vera. Okay, the regular price on this was $24.99. No, $24. This is $17.99. It's cute. I mean, I like it. It's very cute. Um, whether I need another black shirt in my wardrobe, I don't know. But it is very comfortable, very cute. You could either tuck a little bit if you wanted to, tuck it in all the way if you wanted to. It's real cute. And then the um, Levi shorts are regular $44. Thread up price is $33.99 more than I want to pay for shorts, but still not a not a bad deal for Levi shorts. So still more than I want to pay. So anyway, moving on. Okay, this next shirt probably should have sized down in the shirts because as you can see, it's too long. I should have went for a small. This is by Loft. This shirt is regular $55. I guess it's because it's Ann Taylor, but it's cute. It's regular $55, and this is on sale for $14.99. But it's cute. I just need to size down. Now, these shorts are ones with the button pockets in the back. These are the White House Black Market Denim Shorts. Regular $69 on sale for $18.99. Oh, this would be a really cute outfit, I think, if it wasn't for the top being underarms being too big. So, and really not a bad price either for the brand. So, let's move on. This is the romper. I'm confused. I'm really confused because it's got a snap right here and, um, and then it's got this right here which is sticking out like this so either this is the back it can't be the back okay anyway I'm gonna just it's got this little fasten thing that I'm just gonna wrap around there I don't understand this at all I'm a little confused. You don't want to stay hooked. I'm very confused. Jeez. Anyway, I won't be keeping this because I couldn't ever get into it if I wanted to. Jeez, I can't do that. Anyway, this is a, a no. This was $24.99. I was going to see if I just had it on backwards, but I don't, so I don't feel right at all. <laughs> Am I stupid? <laughs> My gosh. Anyway, I'm not going to fight with it anymore. That's a no. I look like I'm in a bag. Oh, goodness. Okay. I'm going to burn up today. It's hot. Okay. Now, let me see. This is the Cynthia button-down shirt, regular $54.00. On sale for $13.99. So, it's cute. I don't have a problem with the shirt at all. It is a medium. I don't think, I mean, it feels kind of tight right here. I don't think I could get it any tighter. So, it just depends on the shirt or the top or whatever, whether you're going to get a small or a medium. But anyway, that's not bad at all. Shirt, I mean, it's cute. Um, it's cute. I, I don't have a problem with this shirt at all. Now, the these are the Gap in four size four women's Gap outlet jeans. Regular sixty dollars on sale for twenty two ninety nine. They're precious cute. They're I like the 
Well, sometimes it depends on how Jean fits. Sometimes I like the mid-rise, sometimes I like the high-rise, sometimes I like the low-rise. It just depends on, these are obviously a low-rise because they're below my belly button, but these are cute. I don't see anything wrong with them at all. They are um, like short, like ankles, like capris almost, but not as short. So these are cute. I think I'm going to keep these for sure. But anyway, I think we have to keep pulling them up. This is what the back looks like. These are cute. I like these. They feel like good jeans. The Gap is going to have good jeans, though. Kind of remind me of boyfriend jeans, where they're not too tight. You know what I mean? So, anyway, I don't know where you could find a pair of Gap jeans for $21.99 that are in this good a shape. I just don't think you can, so I'm probably going to keep these. Okay, next thing. Okay, I went ahead and kept on the Gap jeans, but this is the Vera, Vera Wayne top, $24 on sale for $17.99. Um, again, I think I need to size down. It's, you know, kind of falling off the shoulders a little bit, but I mean, it's cute. It's got those kind of bat wings uh, sleeves. Got the split up each side, just plain in the back. But not bad prices overall, y'all. Really not. So let me try on the last shirt and the last pair of jeans. Okay, I think I have this figured out. I think that this is the way it goes. I don't really care for complicated tops that, I mean, it's kind of cute, but I love the color, but I just, I can't get on board with this one. I never go anywhere that, you know, to wear something like this. It's kind of restrictive, but anyway, you can't win them all, right? So this is the unbranded blouse because it doesn't have a tag on it. So 48 estimated retail thread up price is $15.99. If you like this kind of top, I mean, it's kind of cute. And with that being said, I mean, I, this is what the back looks like. I have my bra on because you can see straight through it, but that's what the back looks like. It's it's okay, but I think that this would drive me slap crazy if I was to have to fool with this. I just don't know of any other way to put it on. <laughs> okay, let's get on to the jeans. These jeans are just a dark wash, a very dark wash, straight-legged. They call them jeggings. It's got so many things on here with the same brand, like Gap or like whatever, and it doesn't really say on these leggings. So... I'm just not finding it and I want to be so careful before I tell you guys I want to say that these are $22.99 but I can't be positive which is not a bad price they fit me fine none of the jeans on here are more than that except for the Levi's shorts so you know they fit me good they're high-waisted they really fit me good. They're very comfortable. I like them. I don't have a problem with them at all. Um, I think with any of these styling companies, you have to, your stylist has to get to know you better and know what you like and what you don't like. And also, <laughs> also, you know, you need to try on, I think sometimes I do wear a medium. Sometimes I do. Sometimes I don't. I sometimes like oversized shirts, but it's not always a good thing to have on oversized shirts depending on what the shirt is. So I definitely need to go on my profile and say that I, I need a small in shirts. And then um, I think my pant, the pant sizes is fine. I do continue to do, I am going to continue to do thread up because I think that a lot of places you can't try on clothes you just don't feel like trying on clothes you don't want to touch things that you don't have to touch in store so it's just best overall if you're looking for something in particular or in this case i just want to try it out for you guys and let you guys know about these clothing options um but i do think that 
thread up would be the best bet if I were going to continue, you know, buying online like this. You, you get 10 items, that's a lot, you know, you probably wouldn't even take 10 items into a dressing room or be allowed to, or you can't even try on clothes anywhere, so that I know of. But I don't think I could have found these Gap jeans for $20 that I'm going to keep and that's probably all I'm going to keep out of this box y'all let me know what y'all think but I couldn't have found those Gap jeans for $20 and they look in perfect condition I can't see a thing wrong with them so that you know with that being said you know y'all let me know what y'all don't don't necessarily go by this top because I really am confused and I really don't know how else to put it on so anyway I'm going to let you guys go, and I hope y'all are having a wonderful day. I hope y'all have a wonderful weekend. Um, I'm going to be going to my son and daughter-in-law's and visit with my granddaughter this weekend, so I don't know how much I'll be videoing, and um, I really don't want to, you know, miss time with her and, um, you know, precious, precious moments with her and, you know, Brandon and Bethany as well to have to video. If I want to, I will sit down maybe with them or or whatever and um so i hope you guys have a wonderful weekend and if i don't see you before i will see you you know at least by monday but you never know i may i may hop on and do one maybe me and bethany will get together and do one who knows but anyway guys i love y'all and i'll see y'all in my next one bye guys the link for thread up will be down in my description box bye y'all